Hey there! Avid explorers of the cosmos! Today, we're diving headfirst into the fascinating world of alien life and the tireless efforts of scientists to unlock the mysteries of the universe. Strap yourselves in, because this is going to be an intergalactic adventure. One of the most prominent tools in the quest for extraterrestrial life is the search for extraterrestrial intelligence, or SETI for short. Imagine a group of passionate scientists scanning the deep reaches of space, hoping to stumble upon a signal from a technologically advanced civilization. It's straight out of a sci-fi movie, except this is real life. But how do these scientists go about searching for these elusive signals? It all boils down to one key concept, radio waves. You see, radio waves are a fundamental medium of communication for our civilization, so it's logical to assume that any advanced extraterrestrial civilization might also rely on them. SETI scientists believe that if there's intelligent life out there, they might be broadcasting signals into space, just waiting to be intercepted. To capture these potential signals, scientists have built a diverse range of radio telescopes around the globe. These behemoths utilize massive parabolic dishes to collect and amplify radio waves from space. They're essentially giant ears listening to the cosmos, hoping to catch a whisper from the unknown. Once the radio waves are captured, they undergo sophisticated analysis. SETI researchers look for patterns, anomalies, or any signal that stands out from the noise of the universe. It's like trying to pick out a single voice in a roaring crowd. It takes time, patience, and advanced algorithms to distinguish between the cosmic clutter and a genuine extraterrestrial transmission. But hold on, let's address the elephant in the room. Some skeptics might argue, why bother searching for alien life? We should focus on problems here on Earth. Well, my friends, the search for extraterrestrial life isn't just about finding little green men or satisfying our curiosity. It's about expanding our horizons, pushing the boundaries of human knowledge, and gaining a deeper understanding of our place in the universe. Think about it. If we stumble upon a signal, it would change everything. It would confirm that we are not alone, that there are other intelligent civilizations out there. This realization could have profound implications for science, philosophy, and our perception of ourselves. It could unite humanity and encourage global cooperation like never before. The search for alien life is inherently optimistic, as it opens up a world of possibilities and fosters a sense of wonder and curiosity. But despite decades of searching, we haven't found that definitive signal yet. Does that mean our efforts have been in vain? Absolutely not. The search for alien life is a marathon, not a sprint. The universe is vast, and it's like looking for a needle in an unimaginably large cosmic haystack. But remember, we're just scratching the surface of what we can explore. We haven't even covered a fraction of the sky. That's why initiatives like Breakthrough Listen, a project backed by tech-savvy entrepreneur Yuri Milner, are so important. Breakthrough Listen aims to listen to one million nearby stars, searching for artificial signals that may indicate the presence of alien civilizations. With the advancement of technology, we're able to observe more regions of the cosmos with greater precision and clarity than ever before. Who knows what lies just beyond our reach, waiting to be discovered. But let's not limit our search to radio waves alone. Scientists are also exploring other potential indicators of alien life. For example, the European Space Agency's upcoming mission, the Jupiter Icy Moons Explorer, JUICE, will investigate the potential for life on Jupiter's moon, Europa. What makes Europa so intriguing is its subsurface ocean, which could harbor organisms similar to those found in Earth's oceans. Moreover, NASA's mission to Mars, the Mars Perseverance rover, is equipped to search for signs of past or present microbial life. This red planet has captivated our imaginations for years, and who knows what secrets it may hold. The discovery of even simple life forms on Mars would indicate that the building blocks of life are widespread throughout the cosmos. But what if, just maybe, alien life doesn't fall into the categories we typically imagine? What if they're not carbon-based organisms or even biological in nature? Perhaps we should broaden our understanding of what constitutes life. After all, the universe is a vast playground for endless possibilities, and our current definitions may hinder us from recognizing something truly extraordinary. 
In the end, the quest for alien life is not just about finding biological neighbors. It's about exploring the unknown, expanding our understanding of the cosmos, and fostering a sense of awe and curiosity.